Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome back to Clever TV. Yay. I'm Jocelyn Davis <laughs> with Dana Ward. Hey guys. And the lovely gentleman waving to you over here. It's actually the first time we've ever had someone from One Tree Hill on our show. It's Jackson Brendage, AKA Jamie. Hello. Yay. Hey. What's up? Nothing much. <laughs> you just got back from North Carolina, right? Where you guys shoot? Yeah. Yeah, I just got back like a month ago. Wow. That's probably why we haven't been able to meet you yet, because you guys are all out there busy at work. You spend about nine months of the year out there, we hear. Yeah. So what's it like working on a show like One Tree Hill for half of your life so far, huh? <laughs> <laughs> well, Pretty intense. Yeah. It's crazy. I don't I don't get to see my friends a lot. I uh, don't get to come back here for a long time. Mm -hmm. Only get to come back here for little like two week or three week breaks. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. But of course it's gotta be cool working on a show like One Tree Hill that like the fans out there love and keep asking for more. And you've been on for how many seasons? Uh, four. Wow. Started season five, ended season eight. How have things changed from when you started to now? Well, Cass has gotten older. Yeah, yeah. I've That's gotten like older. You. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Um, gotten to do like more. I don't know. Your more character's grown a lot. Yeah. 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 What would you say is a scene or an episode that really stands out? Like your favorite, if you had to pick one so far. Probably this past episode. Um. I think it was 18, where I did the cracker stuff. Really? I'd, uh, yeah, it was, we were at the, we were at the hospital waiting for Joy, or Haley, she mm -hmm. was having her baby, so Clay and Quinn had to hang out with Jamie because he was like getting amped up. He was like, I wanna see the baby, I wanna see the baby. So Clay and Quinn had to keep him under control, hang out with him, and they did this contest where they had to eat six crackers in one minute and <laughs> it's like everybody talking with all the crackers in their mouth it's just like foo -foo, and like dust <laughs> is just spitting out of their mouth so that was that was a really fun scene I fun like behind that. the scenes too yeah right? exactly yes. what is it like for you guys i mean you're in north carolina so there's not quite as much going on like when you're working on a job out here in los angeles so how do you guys fill your time and who do you hang out with well if I have like a scene and then someone else's scene and then my next scene, so a scene between my two, uh -huh. uh, I normally hang out with some of the cast members, like I'll throw football with the PAs and then mm. I'll ride bikes with, I I rode bikes with Stephen Coletti uh, Very cool. before we came back. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so I'll do, I'll do all that fun stuff. I'll get props from the props warehouse and just use the props warehouse. That's nice of them to hook you up like that. And I'm sure that you guys get to hang out, you know, even offset sometimes too. Do you have any fun memories from your cast members? I heard that some of them actually took you to the movies and hooked you up yeah. with an Xbox or something. Yes. Whoa, what's up with that? Spoiled. Yes. <laughs> Tell us the story. Break it down. Well, it's normally Chantel and Rob. They're like, they're the closest to me. Mm -hmm. I hang out with them a lot. Uh, go to the movies. Chantel and Rob bought me an Xbox. Lucky guy. <laughs> when I when I brought it home to my mom, I'm like, I was carrying it walking walking home, and I'm like, I turned to Chantel. My mom is not gonna let me have this, just so you know. <laughs> so I got home and I and I said, Mom, look what fell out of the sky into my arms. <laughs> and she's like. No, no, take that back. And Chantel's <laughs> like, no, I bought it for him. He can keep it. So it was it was pretty cool. I got nice. an Xbox. Nice. How cool. So you have a lot of scenes with Bethany Joy Galliotti and Chad Michael Murray. What's it like working with them and what are they like in real life? Well, it's fun working with Joy because she's she's kind of silly uh -huh. and stuff like that. We hang out, we hang out a lot. Uh Chad when before he went off the mm -hmm. show, uh, we I'd play football with him. I'd normally play football with him and not the PAs and stuff. So the two of them, they're they're the silly and fun people. They're cool. Nice. Now you mentioned that he, you know, went off the show, not gonna be coming back for hopefully the next season. What's going on with the show? Fans wanna know, is there gonna be a season nine? 
I don't know yet. They, we haven't got the word. And what so. are you hoping happens? Like, what's your dream for One Tree Hill? I don't know. I like, I like a lot of stunts, so hopefully Jamie can do more stunts and stuff like that. Crazy, Ooh. you've already actually done some stunts, right? Yeah. Yeah, I drowned in a pool. Well, drowned. Yeah, I had to hold. Point. <laughs> <laughs> I had to hold my breath for like 20 seconds or something. Yeah, and you oh drowned. Your character has drowned twice now, right? Is that true? No, he only, Jamie only drowned once in season five. Okay. But episode 11 of season eight. Oh, that's right. Yeah, the it was it thing. was the hurricane episode. He didn't really drown. He was just trying to go for air. Waters might be your thing. I don't know. I don't know. Interesting. Very interesting. We have three more episodes of this season oh coming gosh. up. Um, and I hear that there's going to be like some sort of flash forward possibly in the last episode. What does that mean for your character? Are you going to like grow a little bit or something? I don't know. Um, the last, the season finale is, um, is from the beginning of the episode okay. to the end of the episode is a whole year. Okay, cool. Wow. So, yeah. Very cool. Yeah. Some cool stuff for Jamie gonna happen. How do they make you look a whole year older like that? How do they do that? Well, Jamie, from the beginning of the episode, he's eight, but I'm 10. So by the end of the episode, he's nine. So I'm already two years older and then Anyways. one year older. Yeah. So very, you just act cool. more mature, right? Yes. <laughs> a little more like your own age. I love it. I love it. I want to hear your perspective on why you think so many fans out there just like cannot get enough of One Tree Hill. What is it about the show that makes it so amazing? I don't know. Probably all the drama. All the drama. <laughs> that, that, that's, that's what I think because there's, there's a lot of stuff happening throughout all the seasons. So I, I think that's it. And, and that's I, what keeps people coming I feel coming like back. there will be a whole lot more drama these next few episodes. Yeah, oh, probably. Yeah. Now with the baby in the mix and everything. Yeah, yeah. Whole baby. new world. What's it like working with a baby? Is the baby a lot of drama? Just a total. <laughs> hard work, isn't lots it? Lots of diva action. <laughs> yeah. Um, when we were shooting the episode, 24-7, Eight hours a day, the babies were just crying. They did not like being. They did not like being in front of the cameras. There, they were 24/7 crying. So, oh my crazy. gosh. <laughs> well, Jackson, thank you so much for stopping by our studio. I can't wait to see what's gonna happen. I want to see you. Out. I want to see you age an entire year in one episode. That's what I'm excited to see. Oh yeah, and it's coming up just in a few weeks. May 17th is the season finale. Yep. And uh, again, thanks for stopping by and come back anytime. Thanks You're for always welcome me. here. Yeah. yeah. And you guys stick with us right here at Clever TV for all the latest on Jackson as well as One Tree Hill. We'll have it right here for you. I'm Jocelyn Davis with Dana Ward. Have a great day. Bye guys. Bye.